The Shaytards is a channel on YouTube featuring a family of six broadcasting a select few moments of their daily lives for the last three years. If you've been watching as long as I have, you've seen Shay go from a chubby ninja roof hopping type of guy to a very fit multi-marathoner. Recently, a part of their dress was shown very briefly on a daily vlog of theirs, and a editor corrected it, but not before someone found their address uh, using Google Street View, I guess, uh, to, and they posted their address in the comments of that video. Shay mentioned the incident in the following video primarily to wish his mother Larry a happy Mother's Day. He said his family would be safe, that they had sufficient means to protect themselves, that they had a good security system, and he said he was a good husband and he wouldn't let anything happen to his family. Meanwhile, in the background, Shay's brother Casey was making pistol gestures with his fingers and making gunshot noises. The purpose of this video is not to place any blame. If that were my purpose, I would place blame on the person that posted the address in the comments. That's not why I'm making this video, but it does illustrate my point. This is why I'm making this video. Some of the Shaytard's audience is very loyal and very vocal and very protective about keeping the family's privacy private. Obversely, there are audience members whose sole purpose is to criticize their every move and deprive them of their privacy. Now, knowing people like that are watching, I'm wondering when one of those people is going to take up the challenge and find out definitively just how well protected you are. Now, of course, saying you have a security system saying you're well protected, even with air quotes, and your brother shooting up the tampon aisle, it shouldn't be thought of as a, as a challenge. But sometimes it is taken that way. Sometimes people think that Jodie Foster will be impressed if they shoot Ronald Reagan. However people think, like, who knows? Who knows what's going on in some people's heads? A reasonable person would say, fine, everything is under control, they have a security system, and it sounds like they have a pistol, everything is fine. New video, next day, it's over with. However, it's not the reasonable people that I'm concerned about. Let me qualify my comments by saying this, okay? Because the tone of this video is a little dark. I wish nothing but success and happiness for the Butler clan and I want them to continue doing what they're doing with Maker Studios and with uh, the daily vlogs for as long as possible. Nothing lasts forever except families. I like to see the kids grow up and I, I want to continue to do that. I've, I've been around the block a couple of times and I've seen the extraordinary things that people can do, both good and horrible. And uh, it's the horrible things that concern me. Uh, I know it's your job to downplay these things. Um, and I hope all sorts of things are going on behind the scenes um, that we don't know about. <laughs> some of you guys just love the drama. I'm not going to lie. Not going to lie. Come on, be honest. Some of you guys are really freaking out about nothing. So tell me, am I loving the drama like Shay says? Or do I have a legitimate concern? I know you have an opinion. Let me hear it. Okay? Leave it a comment or a video response, and I'd be happy to get back to you and talk this out more. Thanks. Have a good day.